Here today to deal with uh, what's commonly known in the building as the adoptees bill. What it does is it provides equal opportunity to people born before a certain time in life that have been denied access to their birth records, which has a tremendous impact on medical records, on their own personal history and so on. And so today that bill is going to go forward. Um, it's on the Senate agenda. I want to first of all thank Karen for her, her real efforts on this. We see this as a matter of equality for adoptees, especially uh, older adoptees. Um, who are frankly passing from this life without having the same treatment of the law as the other adoptees. We see it as a medical, matter of medical history and a matter of a basic fundamental humanity. The important thing is, is just what, what Karen said um, in talking to our geneticists. Um, the, the, one of the quotes is that participation in the human community is, is as, as important and if not more important than any information that you can get from gene or genomic um, testing. Uh, and and con continue to tell us that the information gleaned from medical history is still much more important than what they can get from that genetic testing at this point. I think some people, they think of adoption, they think of children, but we're all adults now, and we believe that as adults we can handle our information and our relationships just like everybody else. And I want to, again, Karen Caffrey, you're one of Connecticut's heroes. Uh, oh. And, and I, I truly mean that because you've opened the door, we're going to pass this. I think both houses are going to pass it overwhelmingly. And uh, you, up, you provided a real opportunity for a lot of people that have been denied access uh, to their own records, which really has a personal impact mm. that, uh, that is, is long term and uh, it, it won't happen after this. So I thank you. I thank you. Thank you both.